Hi viewers, welcome back. Today again come up with another videos and today video about this uh, key starting switch. Okay, so this key starting switch is become free. It's not little free. You can see I will try to own it so it become on. Okay, so problem is this one. When operator come, he push this uh, light, push little forward like this, and then press it become free so it's no on you can see it's become free but it's a good one here you can see this is a I know I'm going to open it and check what's the problem when it's go inside little it come free no on okay like sense you can see like this but it's here here's become free and it is is okay here is okay it's become on you can also heard the sound also you can see it's on so it's a problem is here so now i'm going to open check maybe back side is lock broken so i remove this uh, this strip what is here allen key bolt and one bolt is uh, here so i'm going to remove this strip and back side i check what is the problem to this uh, uh, switch so first i stop uh, my videos here and I open it then so here as you can see I have removed this uh, strip okay okay so I remove this strip so back side come to back sides here you can see this one this one is our switch and you can see this these wires are twisted because this uh, switch is become free and uh, these wires this uh, this uh, switch is uh, rotating rotating and these wires become twisted okay so this is strip strip i remove it okay you can see so now i going to open the switch and repair it so if you for removing these uh, i already connector removed these two connector from this switch four allen key bolt one two three and four these fold bolt i will remove okay so then this cover this cover will uh, remove and after it I will remove the switch so I'm going to first I remove this by using the small allen key so this allen key is a T16 you can see this is a T16 allen key I will use it and remove these uh, bolts so as you can see I have removed this switch so this cover was uh, here was the four nut bolt which i was showing you inside the this strip so here i remove four bolt and after it so i think so i check it it has no any problem it's a key is okay just i think this bolt was a uh, this bolt was a little loose so as this nut was loose therefore this was a uh, uh, moving so I just uh, now fix outside and check in front of you I fixing this one here outside not inside a strip and then let you know so as you can see in front of you I fix it this bolt is a so I fix this one bolt very tight here so now I'm going to check so you can see now is working good now I'm going to open this one I show you what is what was the issue you can see here is the here's the you can see here this lock here are one one here and there are two lock they are fixing the locks fixing here this side and this side so when we fix it here so you can see this lock this lock not moving if it good tight then it not moving actually this uh, bolt is not was loose and it go little like this and it moving like this so this lock was uh, become loose 
due to this not loose so this was the problem okay so hair lock you can see hair lock fixing like hair like this so this not become hairs not become loose so this lock little come like hair and therefore this moving like hair this was the problem so my problem is solved there is not big issue so only Actually, problem was this nut. This nut was loose. There was this uh, uh, key switch was moving and become free. So now I'm going to fix back this nut tightly, and my problem is well finished. You can see I have fixed this cover. Now I'm going to fix this uh, switch from the back side. So this switch, like here, like this. Okay. So here his lock become front okay so after we fix the so this bolt so no this nut i will fix it here like here the one hand is need to back side okay so it is the now so, okay. i have tied it with my this plier okay so now i'm going to this is a cover of this uh, nut, so I'm going to fix it. It has back also. In this way, yeah, fix this nut back, and this one is our final cover. This is a showing little indicator where we put the key. So here you can see this is lock, and this lock will come here. This. So we fix it like this here. I not opening time I not show you, but this one is free first remove it. Okay. So now this is a complete work. So I will put my key here. So you can see is here my key. So I first I fix this strip okay see fix strap back here okay so then I will show you this time I power off my uh, uh, my shovel I switched off from the battery sides so far as safety precautions you people also whenever you working this like type of work you have to switch off your machine so this is the back side I fixed the harness connectors okay so, so here you can see now I have fixed this uh, strip now I'm going to tight this bolt this allen key bolt I'm going to tight it of this uh, switch strip okay this is the last one second and last one Okay, going to on. I show you where is battery switch. This is a Volvo wheel loader. So here you can see this is our battery switch. Okay, near the stairs. Here are. I will going to on it. This is chubby switch. Now you can light is become on. Okay, so I on the battery switch. Okay, now my machine is getting the current. So now I'm inside the cabin. So this is my key switch. This is the on position. You can see now my key is on. So now I'm going to start it. So my loader is okay now. So you can see now it's off. On. So you can see now it's not going inside. 
my press noise machine is on okay so start okay so my problem is solved so problem was there is a nut his was loose so this was noise you can see is going inside but not slip not slip is working on off on complete on huh? this is off this is two step now is on after start so machine is start okay so my problem is finished so you see how i solve my problem hope you like this video please don't forget to subscribe my channel and share this video to your friends also give a like to this video so this one is